Welcome to the deep dive. Today, uh, we're going to be talking about roofing contractors. Oh, always a hot topic. And um, we're going to be looking at A Plus Roofing's YS page okay. to kind of like see what they highlight as their main selling points. Interesting. Yeah, they're big pitch to customers. Yeah. So first thing that jumped out at me, they make a point of saying they're not just residential, they do commercial roofing too. Oh, so they're versatile. That's good to know. Broadens their appeal for sure. Right. Like you might think, oh, A plus roofing, it's just houses. But no, they've got you covered for like, I don't know, apartment complexes or whatever. Exactly. And they actually list out a bunch of different services within each category. Oh, yeah. Like what? So for residential, you've got the obvious roofing, insulation, siding. The basics. Makes sense. But then they also list gutters, windows, even skylights. Wow. So they really are going for that whole package deal. It seems that way. And on the commercial side, same thing. Different types of roofing, obviously. And then storm damage repair, which, let's be real, that's probably a big one for commercial property. Oh, for sure. Those flat roofs especially can take a beating. Exactly. But they also mentioned gutters for commercial, which I found kind of interesting. Hmm. Yeah, you don't always think about that. Yeah. Maybe it's more common than I realize. <laughs> Could be. But anyway... What really caught my eye was their whole pitch around technology. Oh, yeah. They go all in on that, don't they? They do. And they don't just say like, oh, we use the latest technology. They actually name drop the specific software they use. Yeah, they're not messing around. They're like, we use Acolinks for project tracking. And here's why that matters to you. Exactly. And then there's Zactimate for pricing, which this is a big deal because that's what a lot of insurance companies use. Oh, really? I did not know that. Mm -hmm. So it's like they're speaking the insurance company's language, which could be super helpful for homeowners. Oh, 100%. Mm -hmm. Especially if you're dealing with storm damage, you want someone who knows the ins and outs of insurance claims. Exactly. And hold on, it gets even more high tech. They use Eagle View for aerial roof measurements. Wait, what? Aerial? Yeah, like satellite imagery. No way. Yep. They're not climbing up on your roof with a tape measure. They're using satellites to get precise measurements. That's wild. And then they top it all off with Hail Watch for, you guessed it, tracking hailstorms. It's like they're one step ahead of the weather. Right. So they're clearly tech savvy. Yeah. But what about the people behind the tech? Well, they describe themselves as roofing doctors and surgeons, which... Okay. Little cheesy, I'll admit. Yeah, a tad dramatic. But... Hey, at least it's memorable. That's true. And they do back it up with a whole slew of certifications. Oh, yeah. They go all out on the credentials. HAV cer certified inspectors, GIF master elite contractor. The list goes on. Yeah. And for those of us who don't speak roofing, what does all that even mean? Well, HAG certified inspectors are a big deal. HA engineering is like the gold standard for roofing inspections. Okay. Got it. So having those certifications means they're trained to spot even the tiniest bit of damage, which could save you a ton of money and headaches down the road. Makes sense. And then there's the GAF Master Elite Contractor thing. Apparently, only 3% of roofers get that designation. That's what they claim. But, but yeah, it's a big deal. GAF is one of the leading roofing manufacturers. And to become a Master Elite Contractor, you have to meet all these strict requirements. Like what? Oh, you know, ongoing training, using specific installation methods, maintaining a certain level of insurance. So basically, GAF is vouching for them, saying, yeah, these guys know their stuff. Pretty much. OK, so lots of fancy titles and certifications. But what does all this mean for the average homeowner? Well, in theory, it means you're getting top notch quality and peace of mind. You know, you're not hiring some fly by night operation. Yeah. These guys are the real deal. That's reassuring. But certifications aside, they also seem to really emphasize customer service. Oh, absolutely. They use all the right buzzwords. Hassle-free, fast, superior, pleasant. The million-dollar question is, do they actually live up to those claims? That's what we're about to find out, because next up, we're diving into the mother load. A-plus roofing's Google reviews. So we're diving headfirst into the world of online reviews, specifically A-plus roofing's Google reviews. Buckle up. It's a jungle out there. Because let's be real. We all know those five-star ratings can be deceiving sometimes. Oh, absolutely. It's easy to get caught up in the hype, but a savvy consumer knows to take those glowing reviews with a grain of salt. Exactly. So how do we separate the genuine from the, shall we say, incentivized? Well, for starters, look for details, specifics. A review that just says, great service, highly recommend, could be written by anyone, even the owner's mom. Uh-huh. True. 
give you the nitty gritty, the real life experiences. Exactly. Like the crew showed up on time, even though it was pouring rain and they were so careful not to track mud in my house. Oh, now that's a review I can get behind. Right. It paints a picture. It shows you the reviewer was actually paying attention, that they really experienced the service. And don't get me started on those suspiciously generic five-star reviews, all praising the same vague things. Oh, you mean the great company would definitely <laughs> yeah. use again reviews. Yeah, that's always make me suspicious. Totally. I want to hear about the hiccups, the unexpected challenges, and how the company handled them. Because let's be honest, no company is perfect. It's how they respond to those inevitable bumps in the road that really reveals their true colors. Preach. So, with our detective hats firmly in place, let's turn our attention to A plus Roofing's Google reviews. What's the verdict? Well, first impressions, they've got a ton of reviews. Like a lot, a lot. Oh yeah, hundreds. Which tells me they've been around for a while, they're doing a decent amount of business, and people are taking the time to share their experiences, good or bad. That's a good sign, right? Yeah. A company can't force that many people to leave reviews, can they? Not without resorting to some seriously shady tactics, and even then, it's tough to keep that up for long. So yeah, the sheer volume of reviews definitely speaks in their favor. Okay, so they've got the quantity, but what about the quality? Well, they're sitting pretty with the perfect five-star rating. No way. That's yeah. seriously impressive, but also a little sus. Right. Like we said, no company is perfect. There's <laughs> got to be at least one grumpy yeah. customer out there, right? Maybe they just haven't found them yet. Maybe. Or maybe they're really that good. Okay, so maybe we're being a little too cynical. Let's dig into the actual content of these reviews and see if we can find any dirt. Or rather, glowing praise. Sounds like a plan. What are some of the recurring themes you're seeing? Well, right off the bat, a lot of reviewers are raving about the professionalism and courtesy of the team. Like, how so? <laughs> Give me the details. Well, one homeowner mentioned that the crew showed up in uniform, all official-like, which, okay, maybe that seems like a small thing, but it makes a difference. It does. It shows they take their work seriously, that they're not just some random dudes in a pickup truck. Right. And another homeowner said the crew was super respectful of their property, like they laid down tarps, they cleaned up after themselves. Basically, they weren't your typical messy contractors. Music to a homeowner's ears. Right. And speaking of music, I actually saw a review where someone said the crew was blasting 80s hair metal while they were working, and it made the whole experience so much more enjoyable. Now, oh, that's dedication to customer satisfaction. I know, right? They really go above and beyond. But in all seriousness, a lot of the reviews also highlight the team's communication skills, which, let's be honest, can make or break a project. Oh, tell me about it. There's nothing more frustrating than being left in the dark, wondering what's going on. Exactly. But with A-plus roofing, it seems like they're all about keeping their clients in the loop. People really appreciate that they're responsive to calls and emails and that they take the time to explain things clearly and thoroughly. That's huge, especially when you're dealing with something as technical as roofing. You want a contractor who's willing to answer your questions and address any concerns you might have. Absolutely. And it's not just about being available. It's also about being proactive. Like how so? Well, for example, one reviewer mentioned that a Roofing sent them daily updates with photos and progress reports. They didn't even have to ask. Now, that's impressive. They're not just telling you they're doing a good job. They're showing you. Exactly. Talk about transparency. So we've dug deep into a Roofing's online presence, their YS page, all those glowing reviews. They really seem to have their act together. They do. But as always, the million dollar question is, what does this all mean for you, the listener? Right. How do you take all this information and actually use it to make a smart decision? Because at the end of the day, choosing a roofing contractor is a big deal. It's not like picking out a new pair of shoes. You can't just return a roof if you don't like yeah, it. Exactly. This is a major investment, and you want to make sure you're choosing a company you can trust. Absolutely. So as you're doing your research, comparing different contractors, what are some key takeaways from our deep dive that you can keep in mind? Well, first and foremost, I think A plus Roofing's emphasis on transparency is huge. Yeah, they really put it all out there, don't they? They do. And that's not always the case in this industry, let's be honest. True. A lot of companies can be pretty tight-lipped about their processes, their pricing. Exactly. But A plus Roofing seems to be going for that open book approach, which I think is a really good sign. Yeah, it shows they're not trying to hide anything. 
They're mm-hmm. confident in their work mm-hmm. and they want you to understand exactly what you're getting. Right. And that kind of transparency can really help build trust, which is crucial in any contractor relationship. Absolutely. Another thing that impressed me was their focus on customer service. Yeah, it seems to be baked into their DNA, doesn't it? It does. And that's not something you can easily fake. You can tell from those Google reviews that people genuinely feel valued and respected by this company. Right. And that's not just about being friendly and responsive, although that's definitely important. It's about going above and beyond to make sure the customer is happy, even if things don't go exactly according to plan. Right. Because let's face it, no project is ever completely without its hiccups. Exactly. Stuff happens. But it's how the company handles those unexpected situations that really matters. And it sounds like A-plus roofing gets that. They're not afraid to own up to their mistakes, and they're always willing to make things right. Exactly. And that's the kind of company you want on your side, especially when it comes to something as important as your roof. Absolutely. But at the end of the day, the decision of who to hire is a personal one. It is. There's no right or wrong answer. It's about finding the best fit for your specific needs and priorities. Right. Maybe technology is your top priority, and A-plus roofing's high-tech approach really appeals to you. Or maybe you're all about that personal touch, and their commitment to customer service seals the deal. Exactly. It's about finding a company that aligns with your values and gives you that gut feeling of, yeah, these are the guys I want working on my house. Couldn't have said it better myself. Mm -hmm. So, as you continue your search for the perfect roofing contractor, remember the insights we've uncovered today. Think critically, ask the right questions, and most importantly, trust your gut. And hey, if A plus roofing checks all your boxes, don't hesitate to reach out. You might just be surprised by what you discover. Great advice. Well, that about wraps up our deep dive into the world of roofing contractors, specifically A plus roofing. We've covered a lot of ground today. We have. We've explored the ins and outs of choosing a reputable contractor, the importance of transparency and customer service. And why you should never underestimate the power of a good Google review. Ha <laughs> ha, so true. Hopefully you're feeling informed, empowered, and ready to tackle your next roofing project with confidence. Until next time, happy roofing.